by John's Pass. Probably can't hear anything I'm saying. This weather is crazy. Wait till you see the jetty. The wind is going nuts. It's gusting to 50 miles an hour. This is a serious, serious cold front. Wait until you see the news is out here. <laughs> Everybody is watching how crazy the weather is. John's Pass a wind tunnel, if you will. Look at these trees dancing. Wait until I get out on the beach here. This is the craziest cold front I have seen in a long time. The waves got to be like almost six feet just right on the beach here. They're calling for 12 foot seas only 10 miles offshore. They're calling 14 to 20 foot seas offshore. It is a crazy day here inside John's Pass. Wait until you see this beach. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Sand pelted. Holy moly. There's nothing but white water. Woohoohoo! It's almost hard to stand up. Wow. Look at that tide. The tide is just smoking. Smoking down the beach. <laughs> wow. This has got to be an easily 40 mile an hour wind if not higher winds I'm trying to protect the phone so y'all can hear me i don't know if you can hear me at all look at this sign dangerous strong currents that sign is dancing <laughs> this is nuts i have never seen it like this this is like tornado conditions <laughs> That's pretty funny right there. And here comes the rain. Now I have pneumonia, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> High tide today is going to be around 9 o'clock inside John's Pass. We have a super high tide. And that super high tide with this west wind is going to blow a lot of water inside the pass. There's some really strong chances for coastal flooding as this uh, high tide approaches tonight. So definitely get prepared for that. Last night we had water all the way up to the back of the shop. Water all the way to the parking lot. So we had water. Kinda, I guess it's pretty much out of the 
west northwest right now, but it's going to be blocking straight out of the west here later today. I mean, just crazy. Normally, there's at least a few people on the beach watching the weather with me, but right this morning, no one's been turned out here except for me. It should be calming down, like I said, tomorrow. Uh, but then uh, Sunday should be nice enough to go out Sunday. Oh, we start up the fishing, like a little slow fishing. Monday should be the best day. Then Tuesday we're closed for Christmas. Wednesday we'll be opening back up. We have a high pressure settling in behind this front. Uh, so. Wednesday might be a little bumpy offshore, but it's going to be beautiful for the half days. Thursday is looking like a chance of rain, but next week's forecast is really up in the air. There's some weird stuff going on in the prog charts for next week, so I would say if you're scheduled on a trip for the end of next week, don't really bother with the forecast yet, because that could change drastically due to these weather conditions. So oh, there's another big gust. Not a soul out here. Woo. There's the sunrise. Crazy weather. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Hope you all stay dry, stay warm, and stay out of the wind today. Hopefully no one's offshore. Pray for anybody who is. Have a Merry Christmas, guys. Remember, if you're too busy to go fishing, you're just too darn busy. But don't go fishing today. <laughs> At least not offshore.